Good evening, team. Hey, I'm working real hard here to be the best husband, father, coach, and human being I can be. And to do that, it takes some internal reprogramming to take away some of the bad habits that I have. I've got to reprogram the way that I think in a couple of key areas. And here, I'm going to talk to you about how to do that. Have you ever had a record playing, like in the back of your mind, that you feel is holding you back? Have you ever said things to yourself internally that you feel was negative self-talk and you didn't know how to get rid of it? Have you ever tried a new habit, something to reprogram the way that we think, and it's been unsuccessful? You did it for a week or two or three and then you stopped because life came happening and stress took over. Something happened. We're here today to talk about how to reprogram and work through that. And, and it's exciting stuff because you can live the life of your dreams and be the person you always wanted to be. The way to do that, I'm going to show you one simple technique today that works very effectively when you do it consistently. It's called the art of the affirmation. Keyword here to take note on is affirmation. And the affirmation I'm going to show you today is an affirmation of marriage for me. I'm working on being the best husband that I can be. And to do that, I've got to reprogram the way that I think. Because let's be honest, sometimes I am not the best listener. Uh, I'm not the best at paying quality time and attention. These are things that I pour all of my energy into each day and I do really well at it in coaching. When I finish the day, sometimes I tend to reflect and, and sit on the couch and not pay as much attention to my loving wife as I should. And I want to change that. So let me show you how you can plant that seed in your mind and let it grow over time when it comes to an affirmation. So I got the affirmation here, my marriage affirmation. I've worked on it for a long time. I got inspired to do a new one. Uh, yesterday when I was reading this book, uh, oh, here it is right here in my lap. The book is The Miracle Morning for Couples by Hal Elrod and Mr. and Mrs. Lance and Brandy Salazar. Uh, and I've been a big fan of the Miracle Morning series since Ju July of 2015. That's when I started doing the Miracle Morning every single day. And I've done it for 97% of the days since I first read it. Uh, so excited to, to promote that because that's a great book and a great series. So the marriage affirmation, I'm going to read mine to you in the way, the tone that I read it to myself every single morning out loud. Uh, and this is, this is exactly how it goes. I'm going to read it and then I'm going to show it to you. My marriage affirmation, my number one objective in my marriage is to selflessly love, support, and uplift my wife, Julie. Every single day, regardless of how she's feeling or acting or doing, I will do the little things to serve her. I will pay quality time and pay it forward. I will love her unconditionally and strive to always be a better listener, a more patient and understanding man, and to be her rock to lean on. For me to be the best husband, I need to be the most caring me. Patience, understanding, love, listening, reassuring, and positive reinforcement will be my tools. We'll live a legendary life together, and I must be at my best to make her dreams come true. I'll work hard. I'll pay attention. I'll offer support. I'll do it all because I love her. That's my marriage affirmation. Let me flip my uh, phone around here and show you what it looks like. I wrote it right here on the sheet of paper. Uh, so that's what it looks like. Uh, the marriage affirmation. Uh, I have a series of affirmations I do every single morning. It gets my mind primed and pumped and ready to be the person that I want to become. Uh, and to plant that seed and to make that happen, you know, we've got to intentionally move in that direction. For some people, it's affirmations. For some people, uh, it's writing it. It's reading it. It's singing it. 
Uh, there's a series of motions you can do. You can keep telling yourself this or that. For whatever is your way, this is a powerful way. I encourage you to check it out, team, and give it a shot in your marriage, in your parenting, in your career, in your ambition, in your faith, the things that are most important to you. Write an affirmation and read it every day. Thanks so much for tuning in. Make it a great day, everyone. Look forward to sharing more affirmations with you in the future. Bye.